Taiwanese artistic gymnast Tang Jiahong will attempt his second Olympic challenge this Saturday after suffering from a serious Achilles tendon rupture in 2023. He was forced to withdraw from the Chengdu University at the Hangzhou Asian Games. However, after seven months of recovery and meticulous training, Tang's perseverance has paid off to compete in this year's Olympics. Tang expressed his emotional journey in a recent interview. When I injured my foot last year, I felt utterly hopeless and wondered if it was the end for me. Since my Achilles injury, I've experienced so much and have a lot to share. I would watch my training videos every day because it is the most practical way to monitor my progress. Tang's coach also emphasized their close relationship and shared goal of winning gold. I think as his coach, I should be with him 24-7, even to the extent of media speculation about our relationship. Otherwise, it would be hard to heal his emotional wounds. In the previous Tokyo Olympics, Li Zhikai secured Taiwan's first ever silver medal in gymnastics with his outstanding performance on the pommel horse. However, due to injury, Li will not compete in Paris, placing Taiwan's medal hopes on Tang. Tang will participate in the qualifying rounds at 5 p.m. Taiwan time on Saturday. If successful, he will compete in the finals on August 5th at 7.31 p.m. Meanwhile, Taiwan's gymnast Jenny Ding Huatian began gymnastics training at age four and made history by winning Taiwan's first gold medal in the balance beam at the 2019 Asian Gymnastics Championships. After becoming the first Taiwanese female gymnast to qualify for the Olympics at 18, Ding aims to perform a 6.2 difficulty routine in this year's Olympics. I aim to compete with a 6.2 difficulty routine this time and do my best to connect more moves. I think connecting movements is all about the rhythm between each move. I can complete a single movement, but connecting more elements requires training in rhythm and fluidity. Ding's coach, Cai Hengzhen, expressed hope for showcasing their best efforts. We'll do our best and stay positive. Of course, my goal is to help her manage her weight better and do what we can. No matter what score we get, I just hope that on the day we compete, everyone in Taiwan will feel proud when they watch Ding Hua Tian compete. Ding will compete on Sunday at 3.30 p.m. Taiwan time, with the aim of continuing Taiwan's gymnastics success on the world stage. Francis Lan, Isabel Wang for TVBS World Taiwan.